Hey kid, do you like video games? Do you like Mega Man, Sonic, or Gunstar Heroes? Well, if you don't, you suck. Anyway, this is Freedom Planet. It's a game. There's it's some it's on Kickstarter here. It's way past its funding goal by a lot, which that's an amazingly modest funding goal. But it's a um, 16-bit style um, platformer thingy. Um, we've got a demo here. I'll be playing in a bit, and it's got some elements from mostly Sonic. The obvious thing is Sonic. It's got the you know, designy whatever sensibilities, whatever that can't brain today, and it's got some it's definitely got some design cues from that, but it looks pretty dang good. Um, well, let's just fire up the demo. They've got a website. They've got Kickstarter. They've got Steam Greenlight. Um, and unlike lots of crap on Kickstarter, there's like a functional demo that actually looks pretty dang good ears were bleeding for a second there. Um, I mapped you controls. God, hold up, hold up. Okay, so good and bad thing, there's this, um, uh, do I have to get a name? I hope that worked. Anyway, there's this, damn it, settings.exe thing that lets you set your, uh, well, your settings. Um, hope that's right. That's not... Um, hmm. Anyway, let's see if we got... I probably have to quit the game. <sighs> Technical issues. Anyway, yeah, you can set up your control... Oh, you better be kidding me. Okay, I do not like the settings application, but I set my controller to act like a... Um, that's gonna... Yeah. I should probably play on easy. I'm terrible at Sonic. Um... Playing on normal though against my own better judgment. Um, we're gonna play as Lilac because that is a much better name. Carol. That's not a cat's name. Oh yeah, the. We're gonna do Dragon Valley. This is the Sonic-y. There's different types of stages. Dragon Valley is one of the Sonic-y ones. All right, and we've got. Okay, hang on. Let me understand my controls here. Okay, you can move. You can jump. You can attack. And you've got um, unknown third button. I guess that's for your specials. You get um, when you go faster, your special meter builds up more. I don't know what I just did. Um, I thought I had a double jump. I thought that's what my special was. Maybe I have two specials. Just that special. I don't know. But yeah, the animation so far is really nice. Um, you gotta take a minute to pick up speed. You're not quite as fast as Sonic, and honestly, I kind of prefer it to be slightly slower, because one thing I never really liked about Sonic was that it feels like you can go really fast, and then you actually go fast, and then there's a giant spike in your face, or there's lava, or you fall in a pit and die. And that's not very pleasant for me, and you know, after a large amount of memorization, you can kind of go fast on the first couple levels, but I don't know. That was... Oh! That's like... Okay, I double jumped there. Distracted by my, uh, not tails that just flew by. So yeah, there's more of a mix of... How do I... Let me just jump. It seemed like there would be more of a mix of combat and exploring and other stuff, and sort of, sort of more of a mix than... Ow, hey. Oh, and there's a health bar now. I I think it's those petals at the top left there. I'm not sure what the green gems are at the bottom right. Oh yeah, and the gas cans are for... Whoa. Just did like an upper kick. Am I attacking with my like hail, hair tails? It's the best use of a hair tail I've ever seen. Double jump! Go! Yep. That was was not actually something I wanted to do. Oh well. So I was going to say something. Oh yeah, and you can do the spinny ball thingy when you press down. Uh, 
I don't know who the guy in the background is, but yeah, you have a health bar, you've got... I've got a second green gem thingy. Not sure what those are about. Oh yeah, and you've got a counter of the gems in the level. Ow. I think that's a countdown of like how many gems there are out total. Well, you're a jerk, are you? Yeah, I can't go past this guy. This guy's a boss. What's up here? Nothing! You're dead. Let me go. Yeah, I was just thinking, what would be sort of cool, I don't know what the difficulty settings do yet, but what would be sort of cool is if it like sped up the game a bit. You know, because one thing I heard mentioned was, oh, the game isn't quite that fast. You gotta go fast, guys. But yeah, it's not quite as fast as Sonic, but honestly, the original Sonic games weren't too much about going fast as much as possible all of the time, at least not until you were really freaking good. There was a good degree of, you know, got to proceed carefully, but that doesn't sound as good. What do we... We got a thing... So that's our open door button. What are you? Oh! Now I gotta go fast. What do I... Wait, is that infinite? Yes, it's infinite meter. Okay. Oh yeah, the thing counts down to your completion of the uh, blue jemmy things. There's another the green. I don't know what the greens do. Tell me, game, what do the greens do? I must know your secrets. Oh, box. I bet that is for the switch. And it was. Got lots of health pickups for not all that many enemies so far, but it's just the first level, so. Saw a bit of the first level already. Um, there definitely do seem to be some. Not sure what the point of going up there was. Um, some parts that are faster, and some parts that are more go explorey. Those are spikes. Do not touch spikes. Oh yeah, and each character has different um, special. Oh, there's a. I want the thing. Give me, give me thing. Thing. Yes. I will get five of those. Not sure to what end. I. Oh, a shield. With uh, cherry blossoms for some reason. Oh yeah, there's elemental shields, I guess. Ah. Okay, so we're breaking his, like, body hats. Not sure how to describe those things he's got there. Ha! <laughs> okay, what now? Hit him in the face? Sure do. What a punk. Okay, wait. I want to go this way. Wait, no. Ah, there. Huh. Oh, and I don't think you can... Now nah, there's no spin dash. Oh, we can... Can we, like, actually swim? No one ever taught Sonic how to swim. Or float. Poor Sonic. And actually, they never taught any of the Sonic characters how to swim. I think maybe they're just not actually buoyant. They don't, like, actually float. They secretly weigh like 400 pounds, so they just sink right l like a rock. They just have really strong leg muscles, that's why they move fast. Take that tree! Can I push this? That's what I thought with a little arrow there. You're dead. Aw, you bitch! Can I mix and match shields? I wasted my cyclone. Yeah, the, the, um, there's also a button for a weird, like, Homing attack? Wait, let me... No, it just goes really fast forward. Bubble! Air bubble! Oh, now I wonder if there's drowning music, but I kind of don't also... I also kind of don't want to know if there's drowning music. Card! We got a collector's edition card. Or something. Oh, no, that's not a breakable. I thought... Hey. You're dead. Oh, neat. The air meter. Look at that. Sonic never got an air meter. You never got swimming lessons. There we go. 
pretty waterfall. Sure, are a lot of geysers around here. And random floating platforms. Whee! Oh. Um, boss time immediately, I'm sure? Go over. How do I... I'm sure I'm supposed to knock this over. Go! There we go. That was awkward. Did I just fall down? God damn it. No! Get back up there, you, um... She's apparently a dragon. I guess there's... She's got, like, horns and, like, the weird tail... Hair, hair tail things. got some pretty good sprite work for, I think they're going for 16-bit color type stuff. So, there's definitely some rough edges on the sprites, at least on the Kickstarter sprites, the ones they show off there. Um, I actually think they look better in-game, either that or... Oh, hey! I killed you! As a butthead. No, I don't think, like, being under the massive torrent of a waterfall would actually be that comfortable, but... Video game characters seem to have no problem with that. I'm not sure what that red platform was. Whoa. Boink! Oh, wait. I kept my, uh... My charge meter there. Hey! You do seem to... Not have to get as much speed up to go up those inclines. Oh, whoa. Boink! I expected that to hurt. Ow. There you go. You're dead now. How does that feel? Not sure what happens when you... Got our, um... Cherry Blossom shield again. There's apparently elemental shields, which is what... Ah! Those colors are about. I'm not sure what they... Rock! Hey, Rock! Thanks, Rock! You know, you never stop to think, you know, thanks, Rocks, for helping me out. You know, but maybe you should. Yeah, I don't know what happens when we get to zero... Um, blue gems left. Hopefully I will find out soon. I don't know if maybe get a... That! You freaking! I don't like these trees. I'm telling you. Hey, I know you're. Ch oh, and that's one thing people complain about when you're at a slight incline. The sprite gets pretty blurry. See, like that. Crystal clear. Um, go on an incline. See, now that I want her to do it, she's not gonna do it. There we go. Blurry. But it's pretty low res. Um, it's currently at 640 by 480. Gotta go fast. Up. Not sure what I was supposed to do that. Wait a minute. Oh. Okay. I was about to freak out thinking I was at the start of the level. One. Why did it stop at one? Got a one-up! Yay! I will need that because I don't know how to boulder. Avoid. How do I operate in boulder? Go up. Dig up, stupid- Oh, you gotta hold up? That's dumb. I should probably not get too far. That works. And suddenly, other boulder! That was not as good as I did. So many boulders! What the heck? Can't keep up with all of these. I think those are speed pads that I just... Avoided. I should probably let this... <laughs> this is awkward. If I let it... get, If I let it fall off the screen, it was gonna hurt. 
I should probably stay on the ground so I can avoid these. But yeah, this was something I saw, and this is pretty neat. You can run in complete circles. Oh god, hey! Her butthead. Just gotta ah. There we go. I'll hit you in the head now. I'm gonna die. Oh, he takes more than one hit. That's not. F <laughs> Hide from the rocks. Up. Ha! In the face. I think I found a flaw in your make rocks drop from the ceiling ploy. They don't come over here. They probably should. Hey. No. Run. I'll get you next time, Gadget. I got you, Gadget. Hey, he's got like tusks or something. And his head flew off. Oh, no, it didn't. Well, now it did. Oh yeah, it's supposed to have voice acting and such in the real game when they make it. Yay! I think we only get the one runny stage. We got two collector's edition cards. There's nothing on them, they're just actually just triangles. And we will try Carol, who is a cat despite looking like a reptile on the uh, character selection screen. And this is the mode I don't like as much. Kitty face! Yeah, you go around and you beat up some symbols. Because this cat, she does not like symbols, okay? She does like handstands, though. If you could just replace all symbols with handstands, she would be happy. And that's pretty much what, that's what this whole game mode is about. Yeah, she's, um, she can do wall jumps. She, like, let's see if I can show you. Yeah, she, she jumps off of walls. She does the Mega Man wall kick, the Mega Man X wall kick, specifically. What are we missing here? So I don't know if the characters have different, um, modes, or, like, different sets of levels for this. Because I don't know if, um, was it Lily or Lilac? The purple one. Um, I don't know if she would have been able to get up that incline there. Or, I don't think it was an incline, I think it was just a wall. But Carol can go up walls. Whoa. Oh yeah, and Carol has... She's got a multi-stage meter and she does this sort of... Like, thousand hand slap kind of thing. Not sure what the use of that is, but... Uh, I guess maybe it does more damage, and there's no need to do damage in this mode. Spikes! Avoid the spikes. Spikes are not your friend. No matter what they tell you. Spikes are renowned for lying. Ignore the fact that I am a ball of spikes. Ignore the ball of spikes in the top left corner of the screen. He is not lying to you. Tap taps are incapable of lying to you. Especially right now. This is not the sort of thing we would lie to you about. Handstand. Yeah, I wasn't a big... These are like... The time trial -y things, and I was not a big fan of these. But... It seems like each character can do each kind of stage, because like... Well... If you saw the gas can we passed by, apparently Carol can ride a motorcycle. And that's what the gas cans are for. And there's a third... There's the dog. I don't know what the dog does. Whee. That does do damage to this. Uh, wait. Go back. Need to go back and get the one I... Well... I see you have more freedom of motion on the... On the inclines. Because on Sonic, if you... At least if you're a Knuckle... Wait. Could Knuckles even punch in uh, Sonic 3? I forget if he could. I know he could in the um, in the Game Boy Advance ones. Um, I 
forget where I was going with that. I shall get you, Symbol. Ah! Symbol! You cannot escape your fate forever! Frickin' Symbols, and they're making loud sounds. Frickin' percussive instruments. I hate them! They're all gonna die. Boink! Ah! I meant to jump there. You're supposed to jump, Carol. I'm very disappointed in you, and not me. Because everything is your fault. Oops. Apparently I have very little health. How did I do the little pounce thing? I wanna... how do I... how, how do I pounce to cat? You did it! Oh. It's like a sorta of double jump? I'm not sure it actually affects my, uh... Not sure what makes her say yeah, but I'm not sure that's actually a different move. Try not die here. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong with the wall jumps. They're exactly the same as they are with Mega Man, so should not be failing that. I keep trying to jump away from the walls, and I know that's not how Mega Man does it. Think with your brain, tap tap. Yay! I guess these aren't really that bad. It's more fun than it looks, because like, um, I saw somebody do a quick demo of the uh, beat up symbols mode, and it did not look very. That one. What are we doing here? One thing I just really like about the game, the everything you do just feels really fluid. That's what. Um, that's in theory what I liked about Sonic, but I was never quite good enough at that speed to move that fluidly. Where? What did I miss? Um, Mega Man, on the other hand, I'm quite good at Mega Man games. Like the uh, my favorites are the the X series, including ZX and Mega Man Zero. The original Mega Man Zeros were very hard games, but very fun. Um, and they rewarded you for being good at them. Like, um, you could get extra stuff if you um, avoided using consumable items and did so well in the levels and completed certain objectives and stuff. It was pretty cool. Um, if you got a DS, they have a collection of all four Mega Man Zero games out that you can get. There was some minor censorship, which I think is complete horse crap, because the the GBA ones were released, ah oh crap, censorship free, so I don't know why they censored the DS one. Um, Capcom, or Capcom are kind of douchebags about random stuff with localizations. Um, but the games themselves are still freaking awesome. Is that my... oh no, it's counting up. I thought maybe that was my time remaining. I guess that makes sense to us when we got trial mode going on here. Well, this is probably enough target hitting after this level. One hit? Wait. Uh, am I getting... Is my health continuing between the thingies? No, I just start with one hit. Uh, start a little too soon there. I will defeat you, Spike Balls. Freaking inanimate objects trying to ruin my day. I just get so sick of them. Oh. You can stay down there. Okay. Hang on. What did I do? Okay. Thought I paused on the black screen. Okay. Spikes are my biggest nemesis. Especially in Mega Man games. In Mega Man ZX Advent, there's this part where, um, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, calm down, calm down, okay, okay, okay. There's this part in the final level that is vastly harder than the final boss. There's this, there's just this bitchy jump where you've got platforms that explode when you attack them. And some of them are made of spikes that instantly kill you. And 
the platforms disappear, so if you remove the bottom row, then you fall through and die. But if you break them and they regen over you, they kill you. So it's just a whole lot of death, and I think I died about ten times trying to uh, do that. And then I beat the final boss the first try after that. But I've fought that final boss like a dozen times. Not a dozen, but like four or five. Four or five times in one. I've probably tried him like six times or more the first time I beat him. This is different than, it, than the other one was, is, wasn't it? Pretty sure. Oh, there was an incline over here. Okay, maybe it's not different. Maybe it's not different at all. Alright. I do like the little animations. The, it's very well animated. I think I've got pretty good sprite work. Oh, but yeah, that's probably enough of this. Um, you can play the demo if you want on the... It's on their website. You can... Um, Trying to remember how much it was, how much the game costs on Kickstarter. Um, not right now. Um, okay, ten bucks for the full game on Kickstarter, and um, twenty bucks for the soundtrack. Thirty bucks for closed beta access if you want that, and you got all the stuff if you want to give them thousands of dollars. Blah da da. Yeah, this has been Freedom Planet, and. Hoping I'll see it released soon on whatever distribution platform. So, go check it out.